welcome back to my vlog it's been a while i have not been posting much at all this summer but it's back to uni season so i'm back with my videos i will try to post more regularly like usual so bear with me <laughs> i wanted to make a uni preparation video like i did last year and um, today will be somewhat productive so i thought i would tag you guys along with me so yeah i've made a to-do plan for today because uni is coming up for me next week i just want to get everything done like deep cleaning my room and get everything organized for uni today plan is i want to wipe down all of the counters in my room and i just wash my curtains so that needs to be dried I want to organize my shelves, it's very messy, pack my uni stuff. Today is pretty much going to be me just cleaning my room and preparing for uni. My room is very dusty so it needs to be deep clean but overall it's not messy. I have a massage book this evening so I am so excited for that because my body has been aching for so long now but I just haven't got time to go. So, I'm looking forward to that. Let's start cleaning. finally finished cleaning my room everything is nice and clean now i make sure to hoover up everywhere so there's not as much dust anymore i'm really happy with the condition of my room so that is out of the way i don't know why i decided to apply for driving lessons like a week before my uni but <laughs> either way i finally got myself a driving instructor and i'm gonna be having my first lesson next friday my life is going to be so much easier once I know how to drive, so I'm really looking forward to that. I feel really tired, so I'm going to have some fun time and just rest up before my massage appointment. I really look forward to that. So yeah! It's 5.30, I'm going to leave for my massage appointment now. I think it's gonna rain, so I'm bringing an umbrella and a coat, just in case. I'm so tired. Hello. I am going to meet up with my friend Rain today to visit his new accommodation. So we're just gonna spend the entire day together and try out this new cafe that I really wanted to try out. So I'm excited and the weather is really nice. I'm happy. Oh, the sun.
like what? Is it? Is he's front? He's in front of the steering wheel. <laughs> Literally you. just thought it would be nice to film a little sit down and talk I feel like I haven't been doing it for a while so I just want to give everyone an update on how I've been doing so far and it would also be quite fun to summarize my whole summer because I haven't been vlogging at all except from the one vlog that I posted of me going to Sicily other than that I have not been vlogging for the longest time because nothing is happening <laughs> much I've been going out and that a lot but most days I'm just at home chilling and working most of the time so there's not much for me to vlog and I've also just been really enjoy not having any responsibility or something that I have to do so yeah treating vlogging this way just allow me to see it more as a hobby than something that I am forcing myself to do and it makes me love it more a summary on my summer for some reason this summer my mind just went blank when i think about it i feel like i haven't been doing much but i also feel like i've been doing so much at the same time and <clears throat> it's just went by so so quick this year that i just feel like I'm almost losing time a little and I get a little bit anxious about going back to uni because I don't know I just feel a little bit overwhelmed I feel like everything is going by so quickly and and I have just been really enjoying not having <laughs> any form of work to do it's been really fun for me so to get back into the environment of constantly always having something to do is quite overwhelming to think about but now that I have set with it I am actually pretty excited for uni and I can't wait to go back this summer has also been the worst in term of weather it's mostly rain and it's like cloudy most days so yeah i think most people would say that this is not really much of a summer but at least i got to go abroad so at least i had a full week of very very hot weather <laughs> and sunshine every day so i'm happy and i'm grateful but yeah that is pretty much how my summer was i've made myself some goals to achieve for this academic year i just want to improve overall and last year i didn't go to that many of my classes because i honestly didn't see a point and I got pretty tired from all the traveling but 
This year, I really want to try my best to attend all of my lectures and classes. Some of the things on the go was to be better with my finances. I am an overspender and that is something I really need to fix to make my life easier. And I also just want to be better with my time. I work very fast and I'm still able to produce a high quality of work in that short amount of time. However, with the leftover time, I just I just find myself being very bored most of the time and spending a lot of time with my boyfriend who study architecture is very hard for me because it's one of the most time consuming course um because i have so much free time i'm almost making myself feel neglected <laughs> um because i would just sit there doing nothing scrolling through my phone while my partner is just working away all night long and that has really traumatized me last year <laughs> because i was neglected a lot during my childhood so that triggers a lot in me so this year i want to improve on my codependency and just i want to be more self-reliant and independent and i want to utilize my time better with learning more i'm not the best at digital stuff so i'm very looking forward to learn them and improve on my skill and i also want to make new friends like i've been saying so i have joined it two societies one of them is a tea society which i'm really looking forward to but everybody i've told this to laughed at me so i hope that a lot of people show up because it's a new society and they haven't posted much on it so i'm a little bit nervous because i don't want to show up and then just be like two free people <laughs> so i'm nervous but i am very excited last year i did not have mm, i had time i just didn't want to join any society because i just didn't think that i would be into it and obviously i didn't want to make new friends it wasn't my top priority so i just didn't see the need to join society anyway i'm very excited for the tea society it's just kind of like a you have tea and talk and make new friends which is totally my vibe and the next society i join is more for skills wise is a life drawing class i did a couple life drawing class outside of university and i really enjoyed it i always enjoyed it life drawings and and my uni have one i wanted to join since last year but i didn't get the chance to so i've joined it this year and i'm very looking forward to it those are some of my goals for this year. I'm very excited for uni. And yeah, that's all I have to say for now. I will see you when I will see you. Bye. I just made myself some peppermint tea. I'm currently at my boyfriend's house and I'm meeting up with my friend today. We're just gonna grab some brunch and catch up. I hadn't seen her in forever so I'm really excited to see her. My room at my house is currently infested with mosquito 
uh, my entire body is covered in bite marks so i'm having a very hard time it's everywhere like these dots but on my entire body so i've been losing so much sleep because i'm so itchy and i'm just paranoid about being bitten so for the past two days i've been having like three hours of sleep on a daily basis and last night was the first night that i got somewhat of a good sleep so i'm feeling a whole lot better today it's very gloomy today it feels very all to me it's actually quite nice for the first time <laughs> I'm gonna go finish getting ready and hopefully leave by 3 o'clock.